and brightest day and blackest night, no evil shall escape my sight. Hello Toy Fans, this is Iron Lantern bringing you another figure review on Maddie Collector Exclusives Movie Masters Green Man. I got this in the mail the other day from MaddieCollector.com, which thank God they actually made the buying process a little bit easier. I thought this figure was going to be sold out for sure when I got home from work at night. And just to get this in the mail was, you know, a surprise. Alright. Well, it comes in the mail mailbox right here. Um, it has the Green Lantern movie um, logo right here. As well as the Green Lantern logo with Movie Masters and Green Man. Dope collector in the bottom as well as the Mattel logo right there in the corner. Alright. There's the uh, credits right there. Alright, now to open this up. And there he is, Green Man. Now, my box actually came in a little bit dented right here. Kind of upset about that. But other than that, box is in pretty good shape the box itself looks amazing it as this lantern-esque look to it as you can see green man right there green lantern movie logo the collector movie masters green man Love how you can actually see through the box in most places, including up top right there. So you can look down on them on both sides. Here's the front. Here's the backing. If you want to read that, just pause it right there. Here's the stats. There is Green Man. Alright, now to open this up. Kind of cheated because I opened this pre-hand. You can see the box. It has like Hal Jordan's chest. As the background, it's pretty cool. Alright, Green Man has these, um, the rubber ties. I'm um, holding them down so just pre-hand cut those and then just push them out or grab one of his hands and just pry them out right there. Down the side. And there is Green Man in all his glory. Honestly, after getting this figure, I am so pumped for the rest of the series and as well as the movie. This figure is just amazing looking. It has the same paint apps as most of the other Green Lanterns, except for his skin tone, this dark brownish green color, and then a lighter brownish green color for his lips. You can see right there. Honestly, that is a face only a mother could love, but still. His eyes are orange with the amphibian slit right there. I love how they added warts to his face as well as his back. And the hunchback looks really add you know really adds to his amphibian form. As well as he has some scales and coloration on the sides which is good it's a good addition to the figure. Right for articulation, his head would fully rotate, but it's kind of hindered by his bulge right here on his chest. The head is actually two different parts. It has the underneath part, which is actually the cup that goes on the ball joint. 
and then it's the face plate that is this entire thing. So if you notice, his eyes are actually separated from his face. So it's like two separate parts that actually makes him look more realistic. Alright, for his shoulders, it doesn't go in and out, but it goes forward and back, which kind of hinders it. And not too excited about that, but it doesn't really lead anything away from the figure. Bends at the elbow right here, as well as rotates at the elbow, bends at the, well, rotates at the wrist, and then bends at the wrist. And as well, the detailing on his ring is just perfect as the two the by split right there and two different colors the silver color in the bottom then the actual green lantern green on the top okay his waist is on a ball joint so that will move pretty well and it has this weird joint right here I heard one person actually called it John Call Van Dam joint. I don't know what's up with that. <laughs> Alright, it has a T joint actually, so. Okay, that would fall. Alright, so it goes in and out, forward and back, rotates at the knee, bends at the knee, rotates at the ankle, and then bends at the ankle. Green Man stands up well for a figure his size and his proportions. There you go. Honestly, great figure. If you still have a chance to get him on Maddie Collector, I highly recommend getting him. Or if not, on eBay. I know usually once it hits eBay, prices start going up $10, $20, $30. So get him as soon as possible. If you're a Green Lantern fan, highly recommend this figure. It's just incredible looking, very intimidating and menacing, even though he is a Green Lantern. All time, Green Man will have to be my favorite movie master figure. It is just, just sick looking, honestly. Here's from the side view. Here he is with Rotlo Fun, Goo. Then we have Not Kailoi. Tomar. Avin and Hal Jordan. Now, if you want to see the rest of the reviews on these figures, I will post links to them on the actual figures. So, there's pretty much the Movie Masters line for now. Alright, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel. And this is Iron Lantern signing out. Peace.